Good medical morning. This is Watson, and today we're going to talk about macular degeneration. Macular degeneration is the leading cause of vision loss, affecting more than 10 million Americans. More than cataracts and glaucoma combined. At present, macular degeneration is considered an incurable eye disease. Macular degeneration is caused by the deterioration of the central portion of the retina, the inside back layer of the eye that records the images we see and sends them via the optic nerve from the eye to the brain. The retina's central portion, known as the macula, is responsible for focusing central vision in the eye, and it controls our ability to read, drive a car, recognize faces or colors, and see objects in fine detail. I know, that all sounds pretty negative, but let's learn a bit more about the disease. Understanding macular degeneration is important so you can slow the progress. One can compare the human eye to a camera. The macula is the central and most sensitive area of the so-called film. When it's working properly, the macula collects highly detailed images at the center of the field of vision and sends them up the optic nerve to the brain, which interprets them as sight. When the cells of the macula deteriorate, images are not received correctly. In early stages, macular degeneration does not affect vision. Later, if the disease progresses, people experience wavy or blurred vision and, if the condition continues to worsen, central vision may be completely lost. People with very advanced macular degeneration are considered legally blind. Even so, because the rest of the retina is still working, they retain their peripheral vision, which is not as clear as central vision. There is currently no known cure for macular degeneration, but there are things you can do to reduce your risk and possibly slow the progression once you've been diagnosed. For example, one can pursue lifestyle changes like dieting, exercise, avoiding smoking, and protecting your eyes from ultraviolet light. Specifically, people with diets that are elevated in fat, cholesterol, and high glycemic index foods, and low in antioxidants and leafy green vegetables, may be more likely to develop AMD. High glycemic index foods, such as white rice, bread, and pasta, raise blood sugar rapidly, whereas low glycemic foods, such as whole grain breads or oatmeal, can lower the risk of AMD by stabilizing blood sugar levels. So do you have macular degeneration? Leave us a comment and tell your story below. Looking to improve your diet? Then try Thinergy to help curb your appetite. I'll put a link below. Hi everyone, this is Olympic figure skater Karen Chen. I'm saying hi to Team Synergy. If there's one thing I know, it is about diet and exercise. So stay dedicated to your hard work, diet, and keep up with the great work. So I love you guys so much and good luck with everything. Looking for a great way to cut weight and look great? Well, it's time to check out Thinergy. This elite fat burning formula turns your body into a calorie burning furnace, helping you target unwanted belly fat, love handles, and cellulite. Act now and start burning fat immediately. Coupled with diet and exercise, Thinergy is the fastest, best way to meet your weight loss goals.